Yep. He's blinking more than he used to. Anyway. Hey farm friends, it's starting to get cold. It could even snow a little bit tonight. But we wanted to give you an update on Spur. And we have some friends coming to the farm to enjoy Spur also. So come along and let's see what goes on today. Blake is gone. He went with the basketball team, even though his the pen is still in his finger. He wanted to go with his friends and be the manager for this basketball tournament. So he's gone. And Casey's at practice, but we have Hume's little homestead coming to the farm to check out Spur. They want the kids wanted to ride him, and and we love them. They're an amazing little family, and you ought to check out their channel. But. Spur, let's uh, get a halter on you and get a saddle on you so you're ready to go. We've doctored the eye. We don't think it's getting better. Sometimes I think, yeah, maybe he's gotten a little vision back in it. He's sure doing good though. He's a sweet little thing. We doctored him and his feet are looking good. And uh, anyway, just a cutie. Whoever had him before let his feet grow long and kept a halter on him so long that there's like an imprint of the halter in his head. But eventually that will go away, I think. So, Spur, let's go take you over and get a saddle on you. We've had such a mild fall. It's just been awesome. But all of a sudden it's getting chilly and it'll be down to 18 degrees at night here in about two days. So, but... Well, he looks good with a saddle on, doesn't he? So cute. Well, look who's here. Hume's family homestead. Or maybe it's Hume's little homestead. Is it Hume's little homestead? What's the name of your channel? Hume's little homestead. Hume's little homestead. And what should they do? Should they subscribe to your channel? Are you excited to come check out Spur? Uh-huh. Awesome. Is knocking outside our door. Let's let it all in. Children have been waiting. They can't wait for the festivities to begin. Let us know that the bells ring loud and clear. This is the best time of the year. Singing holly, jolly Christmas cheer. Can you hear? As we prep for tonight's visitors, old St. Nick and his helpers, bringing joy down the chimney towers. Better go to bed now, before Santa comes down, when you Can you hear the jolly Christmas cheer? 
Okay, wait, wait, you put the other leg, your, your left leg, and then you can kind of grab on this and jump. Oh, and pull. Oh, good job. Look at that. Wow, that's impressive. She just demonstrated how to. Now look at the camera and smile because that might be a the thumbnail or something. <laughs> okay, good job. Good. Okay, now. Okay. So now show them how to get off a horse safely. Okay, where do you put your foot? Oh, wow, she did it. I was so impressed she did all that. <laughs> good that job. Right. Haley. You gotta come inside to get your horse now. Well, it's been so fun to have Hume's Little Homestead here. Have you guys had a fun time? Yep. Have you had a good time? Awesome. Well, now do you want to go check out the puppies? Mm -hmm. All right, well, go check out Hume's Little Homestead on YouTube and subscribe to their channel. They're pretty awesome. So. Okay. And Spur has done pretty awesome, and I think it's working. I think he's starting to see out of that eye. Yep. He's blinking more than he used to. Anyway. I think he's starting to see pretty good. Well, at least some. <laughs> All right, you ready? Come here. Ah. All right, there you go. Well, Hume's little homestead just left. It was so fun to have them here. They're, they're a cute family and hopefully you check them out. Those kids really do well with the horse and I was so impressed with Spur. I thought Spur did awesome. And I think he's getting, I don't know. Sometimes I think he blinks, but I don't know. I think he may be getting some sight back, but but maybe not, I don't know. It looks better. It's still watery a little bit, but. But, with, when we got him, the most pressing thing that we had to do was get his feet taken care of. And then we got his eye checked out. And when he came from the auction, come back here, Vicky. They put a sticker on their rear end. And this is just, the adhesive behind the sticker but man that whatever they use is amazing as far as how it sticks that won't hurt the horse it's just like a kid that puts a sticker on their hand and it's a real sticky one in it but there is a trick to get it off and i should have done it before now but like i say i've had other pressing things and hadn't worried about it 
WD-40. And if you really soak that and my father-in-law taught me this trick years ago. And like I say, I should have done it right as I got him back. But I was more worried about more important things. So this is really hardened on there. So we'll see. It takes one of these wire brushes and I'm not hurting him because I'm barely on the top of the surface here. And this is hardened on there really good. Well, it works better if you do it right as you get back from the auction. That was really matted on there, but came off good. It didn't pull hair out and he looks a lot better. He almost looks like he has a horse on his rear. That's true. Kind of. Spur the horse. Yeah. But didn't he do good today with those kids? He did we great. sure love this little pony and he's doing great. Well, have a great night, and as always, thanks for watching, and have a uh, blessed evening.